what's going on everybody all right we have another review it's a red wing boot it's a red wing boot it is the new mock toe that is out it's the 8863 in the slate mule skinner okay so this is a new leather uh which red wing has come out with and haven't done that in some time uh, this mule skinner leather is quite nice oh today i am wearing the rios of mercedes roper and the elk butt with my pajamas. Um, <laughs> okay, so uh, here in this box is the 8863, the new mock toe, six inch mock toe uh, released by Red Wing. Before we get into that, uh, just an update on a few things. Um, I heard that the Iron Ranger is being pushed back, unfortunately, and the Beckman release is being pushed back. This is what I heard, don't know if it's true. Uh, which I know a lot of you were looking forward to the Iron Rangers in that slate. They're very nice. Um, so yeah, that's a bit of a bummer for I know some of you guys have been waiting on that. So you have to wait a bit longer now. And the Beckman, of course, you have to wait as well. Okay, so let's get into this bad boy. This is the Slate Mule Skinner, which is really cool. So... Um, We'll go into some details about the leather when we do the close-up, but um, I, I'm a huge fan of, of gray in general. Um, gray pants, uh, gray sweaters, gray jackets. I just like gray. Lots of gray. And so um, when I first saw these some time ago, I thought uh, this is perfect for, you know, how, kind of how, like, how I dress because gray it looks Good with a lot. It goes well with navy. It goes well with um, black, obviously. Depending on some of the highlights in gray, it looks good with brown. I, I don't know how well this one would look because of the, the black uh, welt and then the black trim and uh, laces. Um, but maybe if you change the laces because the, the hardware is brass, uh, you can get away with wearing brown. You can even wear white if you are so daring a natural selvage you can indeed uh would look really cool with these um so yeah these uh these are uh it's a cool leather um and <laughs> how do i say this <laughs> okay let's take a closer look at red wing's new six inch mock toe the 8863 in the slate mule skinner leather Okay, so here's a closer look at the Red Wing Classic Mock Toe, the 8863. Now this leather is called the Slate Mule Skinner Leather, which is a rough oiled leather. And I remember when I saw the boot some time ago, um, I don't remember it having so much of these, these oiled characteristics that it ha currently has. So maybe what I saw was something that was just done. And then when they processed, started producing these boots, gave the... Uh, the, uh, the leather a nice uh, coating of oil so it's really cool these like little bits of here and here these like uh, cool oiled bits I really like that um, so we have um, the traction tread on this bad boy for that ultimate comfort this boot is made on the 23 last so uh, at this point those who own mock toes you know your sizing for that Made in the USA, as in uh, most, or actually all of the Red Wing Heritage, Heritage boots. And then we have the brass hardware on this, which is a nice touch versus them going with the chrome. I like the brass on here. And then, uh, as I was saying earlier, the Iron Ranger is going to be in the same leather, which is going to be really cool. I can't wait, which obviously I think I've showed you guys in one of my Iron Ranger videos in the past. Um... So I, I know that's going to sell really, really well. And this is a, a D-width and, and on the, uh, this mock toe here. And um, haven't done this in a while. Are you guys ready? Triple stitch. Oh, yeah. We got the triple stitch on the mock toe. Ooh -wee. I know you guys missed that. <laughs> we have uh, black piping around the uh, collar. And then you have this black uh, welting going around the... Uh, the boot 360 uh, Goodyear welt on here so you can do a resole on here could be cool as this as with an ice cutter sole would be cool even with a a uh, mini lug 
a Vibra Mini Lug would be um, pretty cool with this, making it a Cooper. And um, what else? Oh, even if you did a um, cork, that'd be kind of cool as well. Um, but um, I think this is a really nice release. I like this. I personally am not going to buy it. This I do not own, and I'm not going to buy this. Um, Life's too short for mock toes, and sometimes it's too short for lace-up boots. <laughs> um, oh, also, um, this boot, I put in the flat laces in here. This boot comes in with these, these um, Taslin laces, but I put in the black flat because I thought that looked uh, much cooler than what they come with. So uh, if you go and you to the store and you buy these, you buy these online, you're not getting flat laces in there. You're going to get these um, Taslin laces. And so um, don't be confused. I just put this in there because I thought that looked much cooler. All right. So no confuse. All right. Yeah. So this is um, this is a cool release. I won't be buying it. Um, but um, those of you who are interested and I wanted to review that for review that for you guys who are possibly thinking about it. Um, it's a really cool leather. Think about it. But I will not be buying this one. Oh, let's talk about the inside of the boot. So looking at the inside of the boot, let's check out the deets on the boot. So this boot was made, uh, wow, this is really new. This is made March uh, 2021. So this baby is spanking, brand spanking new. Uh, we have a leather, uh, leather insole on here and, and the boot. And then these mock toes, like all mock toes, are leather lined, which is really nice. You feel that soft leather in the inside. Really, really nice. This leather is very different. So this isn't like the charcoal leather that you um, have, like the 3341. It's not like that. It's different. Let me see if we can get a close up. Look at that. That's such a, it's kind of like, there was a, a, I want to see if there was a boot release in the women's line that was similar to this, but this is really neat. I, I'm, I wouldn't mind a boot with this smooth side. You know, I'm a huge fan of rough out, and I do rough out all day um, as well, but I like that. That's really cool. And then you can kind of see, now that we've got a little bit of a closer, closer look, you can see that leather insole with the red wings down in there. Yeah, it's cool leather, a little close-up details of the, that leather. You can see the texture going on and a close-up of that triple stitch. <laughs> but yeah, it's cool. So those are the close-up details. The Red Wing Classic Mach 8863. All right, let's do the on feet. All right, so I did the on feet in store because I'm not buying these boots and I didn't want them to get dirty because someone else is going to buy them and take them home. Uh, as you can see, I'm wearing, I decided to pair them with a forest green canvas uh, chino. Um, I thought that the green looked really good with the gray. They pair quite nicely. Like, like I said, gray goes with a lot, which is quite uh, the reason why I like it so much. And so here, since I didn't have any um, any denim available, I put it with navy. These are the same 12 ounce canvas um, navy chinos, and I thought that would look uh, quite nice. They didn't have black either. I would have put the black. I probably would would have preferred black just to show you guys. But the navy looks really good as well um, with that. And I wanted it to add that Re Red Wing recommends the eraser and the brush. Uh, if you have any issues, any any um, spots, just take the eraser to that spot and the brush and kind of just brush out whatever um, happens to that leather. Okay, so that is the new Red Wing 6-inch mock toe in the Slate Mule Skinner leather. Thank you so much for watching. And remember, be a boot. See you guys next time.